with 21 the Grey Argon Maiden Hurdle, 3 miles, Bubbly Breeze, Electric Trey, Agnifa Seagull, Pudible Racing, Large Reality, Jim Murray, Movie Queen, David Uli, Olive All, Mark Cooper, Oak to Limit, Craig Beckwith, and Witness Mischief, James Shea. Seven winners then in this handicap all the way from Toaster, Martin's local track, and he just done the Doncaster, thank you, Martin. I'll travel up the toaster for you for today's race card. And Movie Queen's the first one to show. Large Reality's in second. And How to Limit, they're settling on Del Witness Mischief. Bubbly Breeze is on wall. And Agnipa Seagull, he likes to be, well, say he, she likes to be held up to jump the first flight. And they've all jumped it safely. And the Jim Murray's a large reality who leads now by a length and a half. Out the limit, it's back in second. Olive Oil in third, and then gets Movie Queen. Bubbly Breeze, Witness Mischief, and Agnes Eagle. Setting them down, still with two and, over two and a half miles. And they jumped two or twelve so far. And large reality in the Jim Murray colours. Silk, the black, red sleeves, and the red cap leading from the grey back rift trained out the limit. And the blue, dark blue, with the white sleeves and cap on the outside. In the Shibli pack, silks for the red cap, not the blue, is olive oil. That's my Cooper's horse. Then the DB, David Early, sorry, Uli, sorry, with the purple silks, the black cap. And then comes the Scottish. Silks of Bubbly Breeze and Alex Cherry and James Shea. Welcome back, James. We've been off for a couple of season and let's come back this, this season. Welcome back, mate. And then my wash colour. So I'm um, Neef's Eagle. I have two silks in the league, as everybody knows, the other ones being other Abuti silks. And if anybody new wants to, their own silks, they just close inform me and I will send the pair over to him. Large reality leads. Want to design your own? Let me know and I'll try and do it for you. I'm, oh, Agnifa's Eagle, that's mine. She's gone. Well, I'm thinking of taking a chase it next week. I'll have to maybe think again now. Although she didn't fall in the trials. Well, that's a surprise. Not my hope for the day at Toaster. Gone. Large reality though. Jim Murray jumps that one by a length and a half to two. Out to Olive Oil, who was last, in last season's league. I don't know whether he was a hunter chase at last season, so. But he does have a right number 92, so it gives the people an idea on the handicap in front here. If he is a 92 with thirds up, cap back to third or self the limit. And the toaster sign, Hatfield, they go. When the toughest course in the UK. Uh, Martin Lee, like I said, Martin Leiden's local track and toaster. He lives about eight miles from here. But <coughs> I had to travel up the toaster today because he had to go over to Doncaster. Save me on my petrol. Large reality from Holly Oil. And then comes out the limit. Will be green and bubbly breeze and white witness mischief. I hope toaster gets back there. Racing with pictures, brilliant course. Uh, heading down hill now, they jump the next. Toughest course in Britain. You come up hill all the way to the line here, yeah? and they start with that incline. Uh, they don't decline at the moment, as large reality. Leads by a length from Olive Oil in second. Ruby Queen on the outside in third, and then comes. Out to limit the bubbly breeze. Um, I don't believe he's an on-bread, I believe he's a, a game horse. So, see what kind of build he has for Alex in the league. In the old days, you used to get a lot of game bread horses. And mostly these days, and mostly on bread. Uh, large reality leads by about a length. From out the limit in second, we've got a little nudge in second. Then comes Witness Mischief, and then comes Brandy's Movie Queen, Olive Oil. And the 
a couple of inches of the push along bubbly breeze is finding this place a bit hot <coughs> and heading up bill as they do so from this point on which is all climbing up hill and this is going to be the stiffest part coming up now large reality leads by three to four from outer limit in second olive oil is making good ground in third then comes <coughs> out the limit on the inside who's now been passed by olive oil who's gone second then behind these because movie queen wait, witness mischief lovely breezes out of the picture at the moment they jumped that one that's the third last they're going to swing right hand in, they're still on his climb as you can see, that bill all the way. Very tough course here at Toaster and Large Reality leads by two to three from Witness Mischief in second. On the inside is out of the limit, then comes Movie Queen. Perhaps behind these because Olive Oil got the bubbly breeze, they jumped in the second last. Oh, he hit that one hard, the front runner, and now he's been pounced on by the closing three. And behind the witness, Mischief, and then got Movie Queen on the inside, the great back with the other limit. Looks like Larger Reality that was made cost him the race, then cut this back to Olive Oil. But towards then he goes, and now Movie Queen, the David Lully train, Movie going on by a length and a half. Witness. Bishop second, out of limit in third, as we are only fourth in the end, Olive Oil and Bubbly Priest close, close home, and wasn't that far behind him at the end, so maybe a bit further for that one. But the result, David Ooley, Movie Queen, I know he was big on last season's two, uh, for two milers, and there we are, David Ooley, Movie Queen the winner, with this Bishop James Shea second, and back in third, out of limit, Craig Beckworth.